please do take a look at the car show sponsored by uh, the Shrine Club in Cartersville. Check out Cookie Nuts with shaved ice, ice cream. Are you here to see the band? Oh, yeah. Where's your family? My husband went to go to uh, the barbecue and get some burgers. The little some one. Burgers. You're living high on the hog, man. That's a good thing to do, right? Definitely. All right, enjoy this. I will. Good to see you. Good to see you. Without further ado, please enjoy Eastern Seaboard. I'm Don Weathers with 24 Bail Bonding. You need a bondsman? I'm your man. I can get you out of any jail anywhere in the state of Georgia. I'll set you up with some easy payment plans, uh, easy payment terms. We're open 24 7, even including holidays. You need a bondsman? I'm your man. You come see me at 24 Bail Bonding, located in Cartersville, Georgia. 770-382-2424. Come see me. This is Amanda at Southeastern Auto Works where we do classics, customs, and collision work. We do collision work out of pocket or through any insurance company so you can get other estimates other places and bring them here and we can beat estimates and we also save deductibles on insurance up to $500. We also do classic restoration so you can come by anytime and see what we have going on. You can find us on the web at www.southeasternautoworks.com or call us at 770-606-0665. Hayden Collins, everybody. We're out here at the uh, Memorial Day celebration, or what would you call this ceremony? Uh, why is um, what's, what? Why is Memorial Day important to you, Hayden? Uh, I get to remember family. Okay. I get to remember family. We did our genealogy and had this wonderful thing where we got to track all of our family members. But uh, the most important one that comes to mind, we have an American Legion post named after our family in Seabury, Kentucky. It's called the Austin Collins Post. He went down with the uh, Arizona with Admiral Kidd. Of course, when everybody else heard that their brother got killed, there were several brothers in the family. They all lied about their age and volunteered. Some of them ended up in the Atlantic. Some of them ended up in the Pacific. My dad was uh, Marine Corps. He worked under Colonel, Car Colonel Carlson. I mm -hmm. uh, got left at Guadalcanal, and you know, we get to hear all those stories. This is remembering. Thank you, Hayden Collins. And I think we had three World War II veterans here today. But Mr. Dixon and Mr. Champion are two of our World War II veterans. And Mr. Dixon, what did you serve in? What branch of the service? Uh, the 20th Air Force <clears throat> overseas in the Mariana Islands, Guam, Saipan, Tenya, a B-20 of flight crew. Thank you for your service. Thomas, what, what branch of the service? I was in the engineers in the South Pacific for mm. two years. I was down there two years. And I served full three years in the Army. And I'm sure glad to get, get it over with. And I wish I could say that I was well and happy, but I was just happy. <laughs> Thank you. Mr. Dixon, what does Memorial Day mean to you? Well, Memorial Day brings a little sadness because I, I left some friends in, in, in foreign countries. 
but it also means to me that we are, have not forgotten it. I don't know that they have heard it, but whether they did or not, I heard it. Thomas, I know you and I always watch that Memorial Day service yeah. on television <laughs> and cry every, yeah, time, every time every time they play the music. But what does it mean? I know what it means to you, but tell tell them what it means well, to you. Well, it, it's been a long time, and I, a lot of things I don't remember, and a lot of things I'm glad I don't remember. <laughs> but. I checked it the other day, and there's not but about eight or ten of my battalion left still left. Uh, all the rest of them are gone, and I sure do miss them. And I hope, I hope nobody ever has to go through what I went through in the army. I hope everybody's well and happy. And Thomas, I see Steve Bradley standing right there. Steve. Remember when we used to watch yeah. the Woodrow? We would sit there and say, there yeah. comes Woodrow, and be so tickled. We you enjoyed know. Woodrow. We loved our leader. <laughs> loved him. Absolutely. Well, well, the times have gone by now. Now, today's your birthday, Mr. Dixon. Yes, it is. And you are a young... 88. 88, okay. And it's a national holiday. <laughs> and it's a national holiday on your birthday. Well, happy birthday. And thanks again. You know, uh, we don't have so many World War II veterans. I mean, every year there just seems to... And thank you so... Thank you so much, Mr. Dixon, Mr. Champion. Thank you. I, I talked thank to you. one of my friends the other day that's still living, and he's down to... 79 pounds. He weighs 79 pounds now, and that's all. But he talked pretty good, talked better than I do. <laughs> you know, when they say the greatest generation, it, it just must be. That's how we all feel about it, and, and, and thank you again. Thank you. Yeah, happy birthday. <laughs> Hello, welcome to Treasure Chest. Hey, let me give you a guided tour just in case you've never been in before. We've got oak chest for the bedroom, an antique bathtub for the bathroom, a nice brass bed, something for the kids, a bunk bed. How about a comfy sofa for the den? A full living room group for where you may need more people. Formal dining room, hutch, table, six chairs. Come on by and see us, 188 North Morningside Drive, or check us out on Facebook, like us. See you soon. Looking for great skin? Look no further. Reflection Skin and Laser Center, Cartersville's top medical spa, offers all your skin care needs. Medical grade skin care, laser hair removal, Botox, dermal fillers, dermal planing, chemical peels, microdermabrasion, you name it, we carry it at Reflection Skin and Laser Center. Call 770-383-3552 for your free skin care consultation. We're at the Dillinger pool, pool. Good to see you again, Kristen. Yes, thanks for coming out to the new Dillinger Park pool. Well, and this is uh, Ashley beside you. What's your role here, Ashley? Um, I'm a manager here. This is my first year here. Well, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. All right. What's new? Well, um, this, we spent $1,025,000 on the new pool. We have a new bathhouse. Um, we have new water features. We have 24 water features that sport water in all different directions. We have a zero jet entry that goes straight into the pool. Um, we've moved our swim lanes so they go the opposite direction now. We have new ADA accessible handicap lifts um, so that we can be accessible to anyone. Um, more family oriented for more things for kids to do here at the pool. Sure looks like people are having a good time. They are, they are. It's a beautiful day and we're so glad to be open. So, you have a lot of lifeguards. Are they needed? We are, well, we have 
have four lifeguards that are on deck at all times, right. and we've already had three saves in two days. So I would say wow. that they are needed. What does it cost to take advantage of this? Um, if you are four and under, it's free. If you are 12 to 4, it's $2, and over the age of 12 is $3. Per time you come in, can you buy a season, is there a season pass? You or can, like? you can buy a season pass. Um, they're $40 a person. Okay. If you have a family of four, it's $100 for your family, and then it's $20 for each person after that. Can you bring a cooler of uh, whatever you want to bring down here? Well, not whatever you want to bring. You can bring in your um, drinks and your... Um, snacks and your sandwiches, but no alcohol and no glass. All right, what about uh, special, any meat going on or anything like that? Well, any we, special events or anything? Well, we, right. of course, we have our swim team right. events that go on on Thursday right. night. Right. Um, we have swim lessons that are starting up next week. Um, we have junior lifeguard camp that you can do if you're 11 to 15. And then, of course, um, we, we're open, big opening, 4th of July. Um, we also have pool parties and that kind of stuff too. We host that here as well. Pool parties? Yes. Sir. That sounds like fun. You can rent the pool out for a fee. Or you can rent the pool out? You sure can. Wow. I bet it's a lot of money though, right? Uh, $279 for two hours. That's not bad, is it's it? It's not bad. And that, this monstrous, this, this pool is yours? Yes. And life, that includes your lifeguards. And that includes your lifeguard. It does. That's a pretty good deal. It is a pretty good deal. And this place is yours. Yes. All right, if people are interested in any of this, how do they reach you or find out more information? Um, they just call the Cardsville Parks and Recreation Department, 770-607-6170. Or you can just go to the website, savecardsville.org, and click on Parks and Rec. Everybody, this is Kristen and Ashley. Good to see y'all. Yeah, thanks for coming. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, I'm Tom Riddle with Preferred Heating and Air Conditioning. We've been serving Cartersville and Bartow County since 1998. We have a fleet of seven trucks on the road to serve you day and night, 24 hours a day. If you have problems with your home or your business, please give us a call, 770-383-9001. Again, the name says it all. We are Preferred. surgical suite and dental facilities. Pet Vet Clinic, join us on Facebook. We offer in-house blood work where you can get results immediately. We also have digital x-rays. Come on down to Pet Vet Clinic. We're located at the corner of Burn Hickory and Mission Road. Our business hours are Monday through Friday, 8 to 5. We're here Saturdays from 8 to 12. Hope to see you soon. Welcome to the U Harley Covered Bridge. Uh, I am Katie Odom. I'm the director of the U Harley History Museum located right next to the bridge. And I want to invite you all to come out on June 8th to U Harley. We have the Covered Bridge Q. Uh, it's a barbecue competition and festival. It runs from 10 to 5 on Saturday, June 8th. And while you're here, make sure you stop by the museum and the granary and visit Homesteading in U Harley. This is our uh, it's going to be from 10 to 2. It is no cost for admission, just like the barbecue festival. And you'll see spinning demonstrations, quilting demonstrations, um, see examples of furniture and uh, other crafts and traditions that were important to the people who came to U Harley uh, when it was first started, the homesteaders and the pioneers. So come on out, 10 to 2, Saturday, June 8th. Thank you. Right behind us we have this wonderful kettle. It's um, a kettle that was used during the Civil War in the Saltpeter Caves near Kingston. And this was used for the process of mining saltpeter, which is a, you know what they call potassium nitrate. And it was used to make gunpowder, black, gun, um, black powder, gunpowder is what they used during the Civil War. And uh, they actually, from this cave, the Confederate Army 
uh, mined about 29,000 pounds of saltpeter. Uh, they would send it down to Augusta or other Confederate um, munitions, powder works, and create this black powder that was used to uh, fire cannons, used to fire the guns. Uh, but this is a, you can't really see the kettle from here, it's not a great shot, um, but you should come on down and look at it. It is about 630 pounds, it holds 150 gallons of water, and what they would do is they would dig up the dirt in the caves, a lot of bats would hang out in these caves and the saltpeter was basically bat guano, and they would dig up the dirt, put it in, um, in the kettle, boil the water, and then after all the water boiled off, you'd have this, uh, the crystallized saltpeter left. And then that's what they would send down. So it's a really interesting, really rare object that we have, and it's probably our biggest object we have at the museum. So come on down and see it. I'm Dale Yarbrough. This is my wife, Kathy. We own the Guardian Total Pest and Termite Control and Lawn Care. We've been serving Cartersville, Bartow, and surrounding counties for over 20 years. We provide exceptional service with guaranteed results. Give us a call, 770-386-9985, or visit us on the internet, guardianpestandlawn.com. Hey, this is Joe Wilson, co-owner of Parnick Jennings Funeral Home. Cartersville's locally owned funeral home, serving all of Bartow County since 1977. The biggest difference uh, of, of our funeral home here in Bartow County, Cartersville, is that we are a locally owned funeral home. Uh, we make all our decisions right here in the funeral home. When people walk in the door, they're going to meet the owner and know that we're making decisions on what's best for the families that have placed their trust and confidence in us and the needs of our community. One thing we always say to families that place their trust in us is ask a family we have served. We want people to know that when they come here for probably one of the most difficult experiences in their life, that, that they can feel comfortable with us. You know, all our family actually comes to Party Jennings. You know, once we lose a loved one, um, we, we call on them because, you know, they, they really took care of us in the past. As far as uh, controlling the funeral, um, the arrangements for the uh, trafficking to, to the gravesite, to everything went perfect and, you know, in order like it needed to be. And, you know, especially with a loved one that you lost, you want things to go like you're supposed to, and they really done a, a, a professional job of doing it. Prearranging a funeral it could be probably one of the most important things that you could do for your loved one. You have time to make those decisions in a calm, relaxed atmosphere, and you can lock in the price. In today's economy, you know, price is something that we have to think about. And by making a prearrangement in advance and funding it, you're guaranteeing that those prices will be there and you'll be protected from any future inflation. On behalf of myself and all the staff here at Parnick Jennings Funeral Home, we want you to know it would be our honor to serve your family during your time of need. Please call us at 770-382-0034. Hi there, welcome to West End Pharmacy. We're a locally owned pharmacy here in Cartersville. We're independent, not associated with any chains, located conveniently on West Avenue next to the subway. We specialize in providing great customer service to our customers. Most of our customers wait less than 10 minutes to get their prescriptions filled. We are located on West Avenue next to Subway just east of Ingalls. We accept insurance. We have competitive prices for those who do not have it. Come see us and experience the best service in town. It's Karen Mulney, everybody, owner, operator of the uh, City Swirl Frozen Yogurt, along with her husband, Bob. Where is Bob today? He's home right now. He was here earlier. Really? Yes. So what are you doing down here? Well, uh, I was meeting you for a little while, and then I'm going to be out in town later uh, tonight to see Eastern Seaboard. That's down. where I'm going. Are you going to be there? I saw them last year. They were very good. They were, yes, they And they are. brought out a very good crowd. So you're going? I am. I'm going to have fun. Come, come hang out with us. Oh, I can't wait. That sounds like so <laughs> much fun. That's what I'll do. I'll come hang out with you. So what's new in the... Uh, a uh, 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 city swirl business, frozen yogurt. What's going on with well, that? Well, just this week we have extended our summer hour. So Thursday, Friday, and Saturday we're open uh, from noon until 11. Okay. So if you're looking for something uh, to do uh, later in the night, come by and see us. 
I heard congratulations are in order. I heard your daughter got married. She did, two weeks ago. I can't believe it's come and gone already, but it was wonderful. Is he a good guy? Yes, he is. Are they gonna live locally here? No, they live in Fitzgerald, Georgia, uh, in the flatlands of South Georgia. How far was that, three hours it's or three something? It's three and a half hours, yeah. So that's not bad. It's not bad. So, I mean, you can get up on a Saturday morning if you want to and be there by 10 o'clock or whatever Absolutely. if you wanted to. And, uh, yes. Well, that's kind of nice. Yeah, it was fun. It was fun. So, uh, well, good for her. Congratulations to Thank him, you. I guess. Yes, and uh, yes. very excited. Karen, it's always good running into you. Thank you for joining us. Good to see you, David. Welcome to City Squirrel, my favorite frozen yogurt shop. What? You haven't been here before? Come on, and I'll show you around. They have 10 great flavors, including no sugar added and sorbet. My favorite is Felicia Orange. They have over 30 toppings, including fresh fruit. I always get strawberries. Get as much as you like. The cost is 46 cents an ounce. We're open seven days a week, and be sure to like City Swirl on Facebook. Welcome to Santana Mexican Grill. I always order the tacos, they're just like I get in Mexico. Santana has the best tacos in town. This is so good, we order this on a regular basis for our customers, for um, our accounts that are all around the Northwest Georgia. We come here. We offer an authentic Mexican menu, daily lunch specials, and drink specials. So come on out and see us. Located on Felton Road beside Pizza Hut and behind the Lowe Shopping Center, Santana Mexican Grill, or check us out on Facebook at Santana Mexican Grill. Best chicken soup in town. morning this is Kennedy Hi. nice to meet you Kennedy nice to meet you too. all right well, hold on here let me show some other people show kind of what's yeah. going on out here today yeah. all right let me show what you're selling okay. all right describe your product what are you selling okay these are farm fresh eggs they are free-range chickens they run around we have like eight different breeds of chickens which explains the different colors of the eggs but um, they're just Free range chickens, they lay eggs everywhere in the yard. We have to hunt to go get them. All right, what's better? What's the difference between this and going to the grocery store? Well, the grocery store eggs are all one type of egg unless you buy the brown eggs and then they're still just one type of chicken. But right. these eggs, the chickens get to run around and eat lots of bugs and insects and grass and stuff, which right. makes them healthier chickens. So the yolks are actually like more vibrant in color and they'll stand up more in the pan. They won't splatter out around. So you get better stuff out of them? I mean, yeah. They're, better. they're more nutritious because the chickens are more nutritious and they're just, I think they taste better personally. Have I you think. been raised on this? Yeah, I have. I was born and raised on the same farm. So I actually, when I was really little and my parents were cooking breakfast on Sunday mornings, they'd tell me to run out and get the eggs and I'd have to run into the barn and go hunt for eggs. So when you had an egg, it was fresh. Yeah, yeah, like the same morning they were laid, we ate them. All right, let me show everybody these eggs now. Okay, this is a, that's a lot of eggs, 18 yeah. eggs. What is something like, what does that cost? Well, the 18, they'll cost yeah. 450, but the dozen is only $3. That sounds very well worth, that sounds yeah. worth it. Yeah, they're, I think they're healthier and they're more delicious, so I think it's a good price. Now, are you going to be doing this every weekend? Yes, we will be here every Saturday because we have too many chickens and too many eggs. How many chickens do you have? Um, right now, I think we have about 50 laying birds. Wow. Yeah. What else y'all do out there on your... Um, well, we have sheep. Man. And so we have like 
I think 15 lambs right now because lambing season just passed and then we'll have lots of vegetables tons I think my mom planted 120 tomato plants mercy and like 80 zucchini plants so you know as the year goes on and they start blooming more we will have tons of now, vegetables now do you have to help with all this yes I do we go out and weed the garden and collect every sorry morning. <laughs> Fine. Uh, I think it's fun. Okay, I understand. You you live here in Cartersville, or? Yeah, um, we really live about maybe ten minutes away. Okay, you just graduated from high school, getting ready to go to college. Where yeah, are you gonna go? I'm gonna go to Mercer in the fall. Congratulations. Thank you. What are you gonna take there? Um, I'm thinking of doing something along the pharmaceutical track. Wow. Yeah. So you're gonna roll in money. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> Everybody, this is Kennedy. You can find her every Saturday out here at the farmers market, selling. Very, very fresh eggs. Yes. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. Hi, I'm Larry Jennings with First Response Plumbing. We fix water lines, sewer lines, camera, jet, repair faucets, whatever you might need for his plumbing. Give us a call. The name is First Response Plumbing, 770 386 52 Two, two. Thanks again. First response plumbing. First response plumbing. Hi, this is Todd Browning with Todd Browning State Farm in Cartersville, Georgia. Come down and see us on 135 East Felton in Cartersville. You can find us by the big fire truck. You can't miss it. At State Farm, we've got over 100 products to meet your insurance and financial needs. And at State Farm and Todd Browning Agency, you're more than just a number, you're a neighbor. We'd love to make you part of our State Farm family, so come in, call in, click in, whatever works for you. We'll wrap all of your insurance needs in the best customer service you'll ever find. Thank you. Thank you for coming to Honda Carland North. I'm Austin Craft BDC Manager. We have over 30 Honda Civics in stock at the moment. You can get it for $189 a month on a 36 month lease or for 1.9% for 60 months. We are giving over market value for your trade in. Please come down and see me, Austin Craft, over at Honda Carland North. Honda Carland North, Dana Painting. Y'all come see me. One of our most iconic pieces here at Booth Western Art Museum sits right outside the Carolyn and James Millar Presidential Gallery. Again, another one of our galleries that becomes a visitor's favorite. But this piece behind me, A Meeting in Time, is by Ross A. Rossin. And uh, Rossin is actually a Bulgarian-born immigrant to America that when he became a U.S. citizen, he wanted to give back to the country that gave him his freedom. And so he had the opportunity as an artist to uh, paint this masterpiece behind me. Actually is a, a picture that is depicting all 18 presidents of the 20th century uh, at a meeting in time. And so this is a piece you'll see here in Booth Western Art Museum, just outside of the Presidential Gallery upstairs, and uh, kind of give you an idea of a little bit of the historical background behind this piece. <laughs> 